Today, a bill passed out of committee that would fund optional training for teachers who want to be armed in the classroom. Our Lauren Kostick is at the State House and shares what's next for this bill. Currently, state law allows teachers to carry a firearm in the classroom if the district approves it. But this proposal isn't specifically about that, but rather who would fund the training if a teacher decides to do so. The author of the bill, Representative Jim Lucas, argues it's not about turning teachers into police officers, but giving them another tool in the toolbox to protect their classroom. Others are concerned it tackles the wrong issue, and instead, the focus should be on the root causes that lead to school shootings. And those in the middle say if a teacher is going to carry, they should at least be trained. Now, like I said, I don't want teachers and staff, I'm not asking them or requiring them or anything to be a SWAT member. That's farthest thing from my mind. I want to train them to give them an opportunity to save their life. We completely ignore the actual problem and then we blame it on mental health, yet we don't want to fund mental health counselors at our schools. And then we come here and we want to arm our teachers. I, I fiercely disagree. Under House Bill 1177, teachers would take 40 hours of firearms training with the help of the Indiana Law Enforcement Academy. All of it is voluntary and a school district must approve it. Teachers would also have to undergo a psychological evaluation. So far, the Teachers Association has remained neutral on the issue and the School Resource Officers Association has endorsed the idea of training. Also on the table was an amendment to notify parents if a teacher is caring in their child's classroom. But that amendment failed in committee today. The bill is now headed to the full Senate. At the State House, Lauren Kostick, 13 News.